Good day viewers, you are welcome. How to solve this nice functional equations? We have f of x plus 7 equals x squared plus 8x plus 7. And we want to reduce this function to only f of x. So f of x plus 7 is always greater than f of x based on the output. Now let's see how we can solve this. I'm going to be solving this functional question in two different ways. Let's see the first method. Consider this as method method 1. So from the given questions, we have f of x plus 7 equals x squared plus 8x plus 7. Then we solve this by using form manipulations. Here at this right hand side, we have a a quadratic and uh, here the middle term is the sum and uh, 7 here is the product. We look for two numbers that the sum will be 8 and the product will be 7. Therefore, we conclude on having f of x plus 7 equals x squared plus. So the two numbers is uh, we have 7 and 1. 7 plus 1 equals 8 and 7 times 1 equals 7. So therefore, the middle term here becomes 7 plus 1, then x plus 7. So the next step, we have f of x plus 7 equals x squared plus. By opening this parenthesis with x, we have 7 times x. So this gives us 7x plus 1 times x, that is x. Then here is plus 7. Next, we have f of x plus 7 equals by grouping this together and factor out what is common to them. So taking out x, we are left with x plus 7. Then plus, here we only have x plus 7. But there is something here which is 1. As far as x plus 7 here are common, then we consider the 1 here and combine it with the coefficient of this x plus 7. Here we have f of x plus 7 equals x plus 7, then multiply by x plus 1. Here is a complete factorization of the quadratic that we have. Then consider this as the domain. If our x plus 7 here is considered as the domain and we want to make sure that for every domain we have here corresponds to what we have here but looking at this side it is only x plus 7 here that we have here which means x plus 1 here we have to make it looking the same thing as x plus 7 so therefore we just try and manipulate this so here we have x plus 7 equals x plus 7 will remain the same then for this one we need x plus 7 then after x plus 7 we have to subtract 6 from this because 7 minus 6 this gives us 1 and here comes to what we need we have x plus 7 here x plus 7 and here is also x plus 7 by trying to replace x plus 7 with x because we need to find f of x so just try and replace x plus 7 by replacing it with uh, with x so we are going to have f of x equals so a becomes x and a also becomes x minus 6 so f of x equals x bracket x minus 6 this is our solution to this problem or we can just write it as x squared minus 6x this is for f of x using the first method. We can still solve this using another method. Let's see the one that is most effective between this first method and the second method I'll be showing you in two seconds. For the second method, we have method two. Let's apply the substitution method from here. Let's start from the domain of the function given. We have x plus seven. Suppose I let x plus 7 here if i let this one to be equals another letter if i choose letter u then 
u here is also a member of read number and uh, x here is also a member of read number so let's make x the subject of the formula here so by making x the subject of the formula we are going to have x equals u minus 7 just like we transfer 7 to other side then from this left hand side we have x squared plus 8x plus 7 that is we need x squared from here for the first one we need x squared so by x squared it means we are going to take the square of u minus 7 and square of u minus 7 so this gives us u squared minus 14u plus 49 and also we need 8x so 8x means we are going to multiply this one by 8 that is 8 bracket u minus 7 then 8 times u that is 8u minus 8 times 7 that is 56 then we have the other constant term here which we don't need uh to multiply it with anything that is 7 therefore we are going to have f of x plus 7 is now becoming our u so we have f of u here so this is going to give us instead of x squared we have already our x squared which is u squared minus minus 14u plus 49 then we have plus uh plus 8u so 8u we have 8u minus 56 then we have plus 7 here are all the x squared plus 8x plus 7 that we have above which everything has changed to uh, u terms therefore we have f of u equals u square will still remain the same but here we have minus 14u and here is plus 8u so minus 14 plus 8u so this gives us minus minus 6u then we have 49 and uh, here is minus 56 here is 7 so let's add 49 plus 7 so 49 plus 7 this gives us 56 and uh, here is minus 56 so 56 minus 56 this cancelled each other therefore we have f of u equals u square minus 6x then x and u here are the member of real number by just changing u to x we def have uh, f of x equals x squared minus 6x so here is 6u this is how to solve this problem using two different methods if you have another method of solving this you can drop it in the comment box thanks for watching and thanks for taking your time to this stage see you in the next class and don't forget to subscribe bye bye